The first step to solving this problem is analyzing the givens. You were given a vertex of negative 4 comma negative 3, p equals to 4, and opens to the right, so you know its orientation. Uh, to uh, get the focus, you simply add 4 to, uh, to the h from the vertex. To find a directrix, you do the opposite. You subtract 4 from the h from the vertex. To find a focal list, we're given this. This is how it's supposed to start out. And we're given p, so it's p equals to 4. So it's y plus 3 squared equals 4 times 4 x plus 4. The most common mistake is when people assume that the 4 should be like this. That's the most common mistake because people assume that p equals to 4 goes right there, but you actually have to multiply it with p, with 4p. So it gives us that. So the focal width is 16. Where are we getting? Um, the absolute value of 16 is equals to 16. And the axis of symmetry is y equals to negative 3. So when we graph this, it's negative 4 times 3, right here is the vertex, and the focus is 0, of 0 of negative 3, and the V hugs the focus, I mean the vertex hugs the focus, so it goes like this, and we already have the directrix, so it's x equals to negative 8, 